Hi, it's Corrine for Saw Crafter. I'm doing a guest design team project and I had this up on YouTube about a week and a half ago, but when I went to make it go live, it showed that the file was corrupted. So I need to redo this video here today. And I do have a mostly start to finish on this video. The only thing it didn't, um, I couldn't save was that I painted it and put it together. But this is a, a really simple, project to snap together and I did one coat of gesso and two coats of red paint acrylic paint so this is um, you don't have to use this as an ornament I chose to make an ornament out of this which this was really fun to make I did hot glue a little bit of seam binding that I made a little loop out of and I hot glued it to the roof and then when I snap the roof together it will hold it in there so on the front here I used one of her sentiments, it says celebration, and this little wreath came from a, a lamp post that I had in a village set that I just popped that off and placed it on there. And this here is some Christmas spray that I got from Michaels that I added, and behind here I have some of Saw's clock hands, which I painted with acrylic white, um, excuse me, an acrylic paint, it's an off-white. I did the same thing on this number. This number here was one of Saw's numbers and I didn't have the number 25, I've already used the number 25, so I just turned it over, painted it, and added some gold stickers, which I was really happy with how that turned out. And this little nutcracker guy, which is so cute, I got it at Michael's in the dollar bin, I think it's the $1.50 bin. Here I put some perfect pearls and added some distressed rock candy glitter to the top to mimic snow. And I also used some 3D, they're felt snowflakes. They came from a um, Jolie sticker pack, which I've had in my stash for years, so I thought they turned out perfect. And up close, if you can see, I have a little Christmas tree in there, along with some of the Jolie's 3D presents. I know that's a little hard to see. So isn't that cute? It has a little gift wrap and paper and little presents sticking out of a stocking. So this was super fun to make. Like I said, you don't even have to make ornaments. You can do, um, you could do little village sets out of these, whatever you'd like to do. But um, if you'd like to see the mostly start to finish on this, stay tuned and I will also have photos at the end. I will have all the product codes in the description box below from Saw's website. She has tons to choose from and tons of little things like this and the sentiment and clock hands, fun stuff. So I hope you check it out and thanks for stopping by.